started on the Eastern Shore of Maryland. My mom's family is from Washington, D.C., so we would come over here, and she and I really uh, loved Chinese food, so we would always, whenever we could, we would go eat Chinese food. Seeing all the roast meats in the window, the noodles, the, the Hong Kong style soups, you know, you'd walk in, it's the hustle and bustle, and you know, the, the whole uh, ceremony of tea and how you serve tea, just, it always has fascinated me. Straight out of high school, I went to uh, the Culinary Institute of America up in New York. And then I worked in New York for five years. Moved down to DC here, worked in a few restaurants, and then I moved out west for a little bit, and then back to DC in 2013. I learned the technique, basically a French technique, and working in uh, some restaurants in New York, Gramercy Tavern, things of that nature. But I always, in the background, like in the background, I'd always kind of secretively like read up on Chinese cuisines and have books and things of that nature. One of our signature dishes here at uh, Tiger Fork is Chung Fun. It's just a very authentic Hong Kong style dish. I love it. We basically stir fry some prawns, some flowering chives, a little bit of ginger, let that cool down. We will roll that rice noodle up into a roll. Then we'll steam it and then we'll cut it into pieces. Put the dressing down, which is a little bit of just basically a, a sesame dressing. Then we make house-made chili oil. Kind of just drizzle that around. It, it's a very technique-oriented dish, but it's not hard. It's not hard. I mean, you, it's, with a little practice, you can make it. it it's, it's very much street food that you would find in Hong Kong. I was talking to my friend at work about coming to Tiger Fort and he said this was actually his favorite restaurant. So I knew nothing of the restaurant until he said it and more important, I was like, oh, my husband got reservations, so why not go? So yeah. So my friend recommended Don Don Noodles, so we're getting that one. Char siu plate and chili wontons. So I'm originally from Los Angeles where Asian food is everywhere, but living here for the last seven years, the Asian culture has just started to get really popular. Street foods, different types of, um, like for instance, like Hong Kong cuisine. So um, I think it's just one way for me to connect with home. But at one point, I just love the cuisine, love the food. It reminds me growing up, um, just really enjoy it. There's never a day where you can be down like you have to be on you have to be on your a game at all at all times so uh, that's that's the hard part doing it day in day out it, there's times where you don't feel like doing it but you have to kind of push through and persevere when you have a guest that comes in at 5 30 or 5 o'clock you want to make sure that that, that 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 meal is the same as the people that are coming in at nine o'clock I think people are generally generally happy with what they when they come in here 